the potato cannon can trace its origin to the World War II age Holman projector, which was a shipboard anti-aircraft weapon. All spud guns propel projectiles down their barrels using pressurized gas in the very same way as a gun, although at a much lower pressure. There are four standard manner in which spud guns may attain this, by the combustion of a gaseous fuel-air mixture, this is normally called a combustion launcher, and its pressure is limited primarily by the energy density of the fuel-air mixture, less than 100 pounds per square inch, zero. By the release of compressed gas, generally air, through a valve, such a launcher is typically referred to as a pneumatic launcher, and its power is restricted mostly by the pressure of the air supply, be that from a compressor, manual pump or bottled gas. By the explosion of a dry ice bomb put in the pipeline before the projectile, typically referred to as a solidified carbon dioxide bomb cannon, these are restricted in power by the materials and size of the dry ice bomb however shooting pressures can be around 200,300 pounds per square inch. One. By the combustion of a pre-pressurized fuel-air mix, this is called a hybrid launcher, and yields higher pressures than that of a normal combustion spud gun, limited only by the construction of the launcher, typically a few hundred pounds force per inch too. Combustion-powered spud guns usually have the least intricate designs, the four basic elements of which are, a fuel system a combustion chamber and ignition source a barrel in order to fire, the operator loads a projectile into the barrel, intensifies to the combustion chamber, for instance aerosol, range is very greatly depending upon many elements, consisting of the type of fuel used, the performance of the fuel slash air ratio, the combustion chamber slash barrel ratio, and the flight characteristics of the projectile. Typical ranges vary from 100 to 200 meters, and there is a reported case of a cannon surpassing 500 meters of variety. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.